for more than 12 years. The progressive unified government of Wyandotte County in Kansas City, Kansas, has kept detailed records of all repair and maintenance work orders for the 53 duplex wastewater pump stations in its sewage network. Of these stations, 32 are Smith & Loveless vacuum-primed wet well-mounted pump stations, and 21 are submersible pump stations. This study measures and compares labor hours and costs, outside contractor expenses, parts costs, pump replacements, and total expenditures for these pump stations over the 12-year period. Submersible pump stations cost an average of $2,058 a year, while Smith & Loveless pump stations only cost an average of $1,352 labor hours per year. For contractor expenses, submersible pump stations cost an average of $1,207 a year, and Smith & Loveless pump stations only cost an average of $466 a year. Replacing parts on submersible pump stations cost an average of $1,611 per year. Smith & Loveless pump stations cost an average of $332 a year on parts. And throughout the 12 years of running submersible pump stations, 42 pumps were replaced. Zero Smith & Loveless wet well mounted pump stations were replaced during the 12-year case study period. In total, the average cost per year to operate a submersible pump station was $4,877 while Smith & Loveless pump stations averaged only $2,151 per year. For the 12-year total, the cost for submersible pump stations was $973,771, while Smith & Loveless pumps only cost $576,325. That's a total of almost $400,000 in savings with Smith & Loveless wet well-mounted pump stations. See the full results and the complete study for yourself at smithandloveless.com.